This is Mike Rother. We asked a few people, how do you explain the improvement kata? The improvement kata approach really forces you to think about your target condition. Where are you at today? Where do you want to be? And then doing the rapid PDCAs in between. And the improvement kata is kind of a disciplined procedure that you go through step by step and then you repeat that and from that repetition you start to develop a habit. We've asked our volunteer, Brian, to demonstrate the basics of the improvement kata. He understands the overall direction or challenge, has grasped the current condition, established an appropriate next target condition, and now, as you can see, he's working step by step, learning along the way, and breaking through the obstacles he needs to work on to achieve that target condition. What I was excited about when I read the book is that it's done a fabulous job of really distilling the essence of continuous improvement as a fundamental cultural value to a very simple set of practices, behavioral practices of thinking and behaving that anyone can learn. It isn't a single gadget that we can put in place, but it's a mindset behind it, which is very exciting. And many companies that have been in the lean game for 5, 10, 15 years are really looking at what, how do I achieve long-term cultural change that embodies continuous improvement. Toyota Kata really is the path to doing that. It's, it's the most direct, most immediate, most available path that I've seen.